Brian, um, he had a dream. Yeah, Tell everybody yes. what your dream was about last night. Uh, last night, it was about, like, we were at my dad's work, so we went down this elevator. There was Jesus talking to the devil, and the devil saw us. He, he was madness. And he and Jesus saw us go up the elevator quickly, go up. And as soon as we got up there, God said that he would be coming here soon. It, this dream amazed me so much. I really wanted to make sure that you guys knew about it. So yeah, it was a dream. I'm not sure if other people had it, but if you did, maybe God means like he's coming back to us by us praying every day. And actually, he told me to tell my family, but my mom had a good idea to put it on YouTube. Maybe by family. He meant like everyone in the world. God be giving my mom that idea. So, uh, by uh, this, my mom had a good idea. Maybe by when he said my family, he might have meant like everyone in the world. Because we are all just sisters and brothers of God. As soon as I told my mom, she was out maze. She's like, whoa, that's that's a good idea. Maybe we should tell the pastor. Cause this was a great because this was a great day for God to tell me. This was a good day, because this was Sunday, the day of God's rest. It made me happy. And I wonder if everyone just has these dreams on the internet. Or like, not they have it on the internet, but they have it as soon as it's God's rest. Because he wants people to know about it, know about him and stuff. So, and when I saw God in my dream, and he said that he was coming, it was a giant orb of light. It, it was amazing. It made, amazed me so good that I that I clearly learned, he said, should I ask, or should I tell my family? And straight away, God said, yes. It, it was amazing. This amazed me so good. So from now on, whenever we have dreams like this, we will show you guys. And always, that's because we praise the Lord. You'll see you guys later. Amen. Hi guys! Another Kyrie Ray Ray video, but this one is special. So mom, you tell them what you are praying about, and I'll tell them about my dream. Okay. Um, so basically I was getting a strong, urgent feeling that we're going to come into the dawn of a new day here soon, or we're in the rapture, or the end times, or you know, or revelation, I'm sorry, not the rapture. And basically I started going back to church and influencing my kids more and reading the Bible daily, praying daily, things like that, um, you know, for spiritual growth and health. And I tried to talk to my fiance about it and he didn't want to hear anything about it. He said, oh, the world's been corrupt for thousands of years. And you know, if the rapture does happen, I know where I'm going. So I'm not worried about it. So I turned to YouTube to basically see if anybody else was feeling like this and you know to my surprise there's lots of numerous videos about people having dreams and visions and things like that. So I was like okay that's really cool. So uh, basically I started praying for it for about a week for my fiance to have a dream to confirm what I was feeling. I didn't want the dream necessarily to come to me because I felt like, okay, well, either he's not going to believe me or I might not even believe it because I've been watching these videos and feeling like this, so maybe it's just subconsciously, so I had a dream about it like that way. But uh, basically, I was praying for him to have it, and instead, God gave the dream to my son, Brian, who did not even know that I was praying for that at all. So basically we were getting ready for church one day and he looked at me straight in the face and said, Mommy, God came to me in a dream and he told me to tell you. This is what he said. 
It was the day on God's rest that I told Mom. So, uh, 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 so, uh, so we were at my dad's work. I was with my sister. I was with my sisters. Me, Kai, and Anna, which are my sister's name. I'm Brian. And uh, we went down an elevator and uh, went so far down. But they were in each word. I was about to say it for you. I know you don't like saying it. <laughs> so uh, Jesus was talking to the devil, and the devil was in a cage. And when the devil saw us, he burst it out. And um, so. We, Jesus told us to go up, back up the elevator. We made it up the elevator. Um, there was an orb of a light, which I think is God, and he told me that he would be here soon. And then, uh, sorry guys, one second, I'm, trying, I'm forgetting. It's okay, honey. And so uh, I woke up when he told me that. Then I pray her if I should ask my mom straight away, like a click, he told me yes. So, and that was the day of God's rest that I told you, like earlier. And a uh, thing that's important to me and my mom is that the revelation could be any hour, any day. And maybe the revelation will be soon. Yeah, because God told you he was what? That uh, he would be here soon. Which completely, guys, confirmed everything that I was feeling, okay? And then a couple days after that, um, I was having night terrors a couple months back, okay? And this was when I was not I going to church and Bible. reading my Bible and stuff like that. And basically, my fiancé, he would start to read the Bible to me at night, and then they could just completely stop one away so i mean that also built my faith back up like wow you know there must be something to the actual words in the bible having power behind them so i was praying um this night a couple nights after he had this dream because i was getting that strong feeling of being scared like a night terror was going to come on so i was listening to my bible on audio on my app on my phone and i was praying and I wasn't quite asleep yet, and I still can't recall exactly what it was, like a jolt of light or something like that. Something shocked me, not scared me, but it just like shocked me into, hello, you know, pay attention or whatever. So I looked up at the ceiling and I seen an orb of light, and then it got, you know, about two feet wide and a very large right hand came through and it was holding a bunch of white flowers which were glistening like not sparkling but almost like illuminated I don't know how else to explain it and this was an actual vision not a dream which further confirmed what I was feeling because I don't know if you guys know but about the whole bride of Christ and stuff like that he's coming back to get his church and it was almost like he downloaded into me instantly when I seen that that that's exactly what went through my head at that moment like he was saying you know, I want you to be with my church. Come with me. So that's all, guys. I hope you guys really enjoyed. And uh, please leave in the comments down below if you guys had any dreams or visions like that. Or even, you know, just any positive message that you want to share or your opinions about it or anything. Okay. And me and my sister will try to explain it. We'll do the best that we can. Love you guys. See you next time. Bye. 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 Bye.